All right, what is up? This is Slow Plays back from our Dragon Balls Universe 2. So today, guys, we are truly transcending into a realm of custom-based mods, my friends. We are going beyond custom and going into just a realm that has never been touched before. I mean, you guys have probably seen this mod yourself and have covered it yourself, just trying it out and everything. Big shout out to the homies, Dexio, Azura, and Dcat Yang. And I'm not sure if there's anyone else who worked on this mod, but massive shout outs to them and their team for creating Alina, or is it Alina? I'm not entirely sure how to pronounce this character's name, but I'm so excited for today's episode, my friends, because I've been wanting to cover this for a while, and you guys are probably wondering, oh my god, another OC, another custom character. Okay, so first and foremost, I'd like to mention that the Gokan, I wasn't aware that this it wasn't a actual, like, fusion mod, it was actually an OC, but come on, you can't blame me, it actually looks like a fusion between Goku and Gohan, plus he has the same coloration that Gohan has with his clothing, too, so... I apologize, but that was, you know, before the mod was released, and, you know, the creator gave me zero information on this model, but it was still sick nonetheless. Moving back over to Alina, Alina, I'm gonna just call her Alina, I think that's how it's supposed to be pronounced, hopefully. <laughs> this is the Universe 1 Legendary Super Saiyan, if I'm not mistaken. So, there is a backstory to this, you guys can check it out yourself, but I believe this is either, I'm not sure if it's Azura's or Dexio's custom character, it's one of them. Uh, and there's another one, his name is Kai, and those two are supposed to go together, but I wanted to focus on this character today, and depending on how much you guys like this mod, I will showcase the other, I guess, Kai mod or whatever, where he's actually, you know, a male Kai, he's like one of the first Kais to ever originate in, you know, the series or whatever, so this is going to be really sick. Before we get into it, my friends, do me a huge favor and smash that like button. Let's try to reach 15 likes on this video. That would be amazing, and I'd really appreciate it. Pleasure that you guys want to see more Dragon Ball Z Universe 2 content on this channel, as well as a continuation of the mod series and dope custom mods like these. Now, when I say custom, this has everything custom. I'm talking voice. I'm talking skill set, move set, transformations, auras, everything. So we're going to go ahead and check out the very first move set, and I'll walk through all the different variations for this character. So this one has Counter Blade, Twisted Blast, Focus Wave, a Maximum Charge, Serious Blaster, Galactic Buster, Blaster Meteor, and the Mastered Legendary Super Saiyan and Ultra Instinct Transformations, as well as the Super Soul. Sorry, you were way open there. So if we go and zoom in on this character, it looks like a basic custom character with a really cool looking design with the armor and clothing. So I do like that flower kind of thing going up on top of the head or whatever that little headpiece is supposed to be. It's very nice. Uh, moving on here, we have another variation which has some more uh, cool skills and everything that I want to show off as well. But this one actually has uh, pretty much just like a training suit going on. And then this one right here is casual clothing, very reminiscent of Broly's because this is supposedly the Universe 1 Legendary Super Saiyan. Again, a new move set and everything. This one just has the LM, you know, Legendary Super Saiyan or Mastered Legendary Super Saiyan or whatever. So it's got like Milky Beam, Bloody Saucer, Orga Blaster, Corruption Fisher, Psychic Move. Like, look at this, dude. It's a Time Breaker variation. And then we have a version number two with a different mask, which is just really nice to see. Cool stuff, uh, again, with the same sort of moveset and a super villainous mode. Uh, I guess these other two, or actually no, one, two, three, four. There are four other ones that we're not supposed to use. These are just extra, so I'm not going to get into that because I don't want to crash my game. It was uh, made aware that that will actually you know, mess up your game. So we're going to go ahead and jump straight on into it. And if you want to hear the voice there... I'm not sure what no voice that is. I've heard it before somewhere. I'm not sure who the voice actor is or where that derives from. But you guys let me know. It's probably been heard before. So we're actually going to fight the other OC, Gokan, in ultimate form. And I guess we'll go to a new stage that I had installed, which is the Ruined Kami's Lookout. Really cool stage. I wanted to try this one out for a while because it was installed, uh, or not installed, but, you know, put up on the mod website uh, a couple of days ago. So I was like, you know, why not? So... We're going to get into this, man. I am just thrilled to show you guys all the transformations. It's going to be so sick. Let's get it. All right, my friends. So Alina is here and ready for battle as the next legendary Super Saiyan in the Dragon Ball series. This is going to be so sick. I want to showcase the first basic, just basis of the moveset. And look at all the, like, just, like, attention to detail on this stage. It's so sick. We have the withered away, like, dead plants and everything. This is a truly destroyed... Kami's lookout. I like the design. So I went ahead and actually changed the character to Tarvel, but oh my goodness, 
look at this because you know the Goka mod uh, it actually has like super armor, but look, she's got a green keyblade. Double, she's a dual wielder. Are you freaking serious? Look at this custom shit, bro. Oh my god, break that stamina. That is so sick. I love it. Yo. <laughs> and we got like a red aura too. Yo, we just straight up just killed Tarble. Rip him, dude. This is the most OP, like insane custom mod ever, dude. This is so sick. All right, let's go for it. Oh, 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 dual wielding, boys. Let's get it. Boom. Square triangle, triangle, square trail. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yo. Yo. How far can we go with this, dude? Counterblade? What the fuck? <laughs> Whoa. What is happening, dude? I feel like I'm on a roller coaster right now. The rush, bro. The freaking rush. All right. Let's go for a uh, twisted blast. Oh my god. That is cool. Can we actually, like, manipulate that? No. That's just a nice little green move. I like that. Focus wave. Let's see this. Oh my god, that's like a Kamehameha. I wonder if you can actually use it multiple times. Let's check. Let's check. We're gonna test all this out right now. We got this going on. Oh my god. Okay, so no, it's not like a burst Kamehameha, but it's still really cool. All right, let's go ahead and charge up everything here. Let's get it to about three bars and let's showcase Serious Blaster. Oh my god, I love the animation of that. You see that? Hold up. Let's see that one more time. That is so sick. The animation and her overall, like, expression on her face that she has is just phenomenal. Alright, let's see Galactic Buster. What is that, dude? Galactic Buster. You need a lot of key for this one. Oh my god! It's like a final Kamehameha. It's like a final flash move. That is so sick. Alright, let's use Serious Buster one more time. I love her face, dude. She's adorable. This is a cute character. I like it. And she's going to be badass, too, as a legendary Super Saiyan. So, moving on here, we're going to showcase the transformations. You guys ready for it? We have the, I guess, legendary Super Saiyan transformation. Just your basic, you know, Super Saiyan legendary form, which has the greenish sort of yellow hair. Pretty basic, nothing too special there. But, moving on, if we actually charge up to the next bar, we can actually go further beyond. You guys ready for it? Let's see it. Oh my god, look at that. So this one is actually, it looks like, what is this, Legendary Super Saiyan 2 maybe? I feel like the hair on the edges stands up a little bit more and I see the electricity, so I'm going to make that assumption as much. So moving on here, we have another one, which this one might actually be a mastered Legendary Super Saiyan or Super Saiyan Legendary Evolution in a way. That's what it kind of reminds me of with the darker green and this new aura. I absolutely love it. Maybe this is like... Legendary Super Saiyan God. I'm not entirely sure. You guys let me know in the comment section, but look at the custom aura, dude. That is so sick. Now, let's keep charging up a little bit more here. Let's move on to the next transformation. Let's see. We're getting a little bit more key. A little bit more. Let's get it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We got this. We got this, man. All right, here we go. Ultra Instinct! <gasps> Holy shit, dude. That is so sick. I love her stance. Look at that stance, dude. She is a beautiful character, man. All right, I think we still got another transformation to go. How many key bars do we have? All right, we have this one right here, which is another one, which this might be, uh, again, another legendary Super Saiyan transformation. I'm not sure. Again, it kind of looks similar to the last one that we did. I think these are both exactly the same. They just kind of switch back and forth and intertwine. I think you can just go back and forth. Yep, that, that's what it is. Okay, so you can go back and forth, which is the sickest thing ever. So if you want to try out Ultra Instinct, you can, and if you want to also try out the legendary Super Saiyan, you can. So... Let's actually see the difference between these. I want to see if there's like a difference in the move set. So move set wise, I think we still do big damage. Oh my god, we do uh, actually ridiculous damage with this. Holy crap! Look at this. Just like normal, <laughs> normal like moves that I'm using as the base move set. It is actually ripping through Tarble's a hole, bro. What is happening? Oh dude, I love this counter blade. That is so sick. All right, let's switch over to the Ultra Instant. Oh, look at that, dude. That is sick. Let's charge it up some more here. Perfect. The Ultra Instinct. Okay. Oh, wait. Do we have a... We have a different... Oh, my God. The moveset changes. Are you freaking serious? Soaring combination. Oh, oh! What? That is so sick, dude. Are you kidding me? Look at this. Boom, 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 boom. And it has that, like, freaking earthquake shake effect. Savage Strike. Oh, my God. So, whenever you switch between... The two, you have different moves. I didn't even know that. That is so sick. So the Legendary Super Saiyan has its own moveset as well as Ultra Instinct. This is the best freaking mod I've ever covered here. Like, seriously. Like, I know I said that a lot, but in terms of a mod, like a custom mod, this goes beyond that. 
and much more. Like, it's ridiculous, man. This is so sick. I love that the moveset changes. That is so creative. I didn't even think about that. Heavenly Mark. What is this? Oh, my God, dude. We, that, that, I guess that makes sense. We're leaving the mark of the heavens on this mofo's ass, bro. What the hell? Dynamic slash. Oh, my God. That is so sick. So, I wonder, does her uh, keyblade? Her keyblade changes color, too, bro. Oh, my God. This is something that's actually real in Xenoverse. People made this. Guys, people made this. Are you kidding me? Zamasu, I'm going to tell you right now, humans did nothing wrong, homie. They know what's up. Look at that. And she got a different moveset, too. That is so dope. Holy crap. This is the best shit ever, man. I can't, I can't stop playing around with it. I feel like I played with this Pokemon for centuries, homie. Look at this, bro. Oh, my God. Okay, let's go for... Uh, what else have we not used yet? Okay, so we did the Heavenly Mark, the Vanishing Slash. What is this? Whoa! What the fudge is that, dude? Boom! 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 Oh, my God. That is so sick. So... There you have it, my friends. There is the base form of this character to the maximum full potential. Let's go ahead and move on to the next. All right, my friends. So we are back here with the second variation. This is in the training suit, if I'm not mistaken. So I'm going to go ahead and just transform right off the bat. Like I said, we saw all the transformations, all the variations with that. But moveset-wise, we have not seen, I don't think, wait, did we see the Vanishing Slash already? Yeah, this is the one that we just covered. So this one has a different moveset, I guess, in terms of the uh, legendary Super Saiyan transformation. I'm seeing this dual instant severance. What is this? This is kind of cool looking. Wow. What the hell? I I'm not sure what that was. I actually have no idea what that was that I just witnessed. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure if it's a counter or something or how that's supposed to be performed. I apologize. I've never used that move before, but hey, it kind of looks cool. You guys let me know what that move does. I actually have no idea. So we have Omega Volcano. Look at that, dude. That's kind of like the uh, Burst Rusher. Not Burst Rusher. What is that one move that Terminus has? I always forget what the move is called, but it has that same kind of effect where it creates like this shock wave that bursts up from like, you know, the bottom. Like a Heat Dome attack. Almost, more like that. Maybe it's like, uh, it's like Buster or something. I, I honestly can't even remember. We have the Gigantic Omega. I love the custom uh, sounds, like the SFX that's going on here. We have Cross Splitter, which is so sick. Yo, do you know what that reminds me of? It reminds me of X Scissor, dude. X Scissor from Pokemon. Because it's like a bug type move and it's green. Dude, we got freaking X Scissor up in this. Let's go, dude. X Scissor. I love it. Legendary Breaker. Let's see this. Oh my god. Oh crap. Yo, what the fudge was that, bro? We started into like Atomic Blaster. Look at that. That is some, like, mutation going on, bro. That is sick. I love it. So, there is pretty much all of the moves for the second variation in their full glory. Again, the blaster meter is always nice to have, but there you have it. The legendary Super Saiyan is here. All right, my friends. So, we're back again, and this time we're doing the casual clothing the most traditional way that we can actually see the full potential of this character. So, what is this right here? Wait, what just happened? Whoa, the camera got all messed up. That is weird. Uh, I'm not sure what just happened. Did I mess up the camera or something? That is weird looking. What? Uh, let me just restart that. I don't know what happened. This has got to be some kind of glitch on this stage. Look at this, dude. Wait, what happened, dude? Oh, my God. I, I didn't even know you could do this. Yo, this is kind of sick. We're at a weird angle. I'm not sure if that's the transformation's fault or not. That is very strange. It might actually be. It might actually be some kind of issue. I'm not sure what that is, but yeah, the legendary Super Saiyan God, I mean, maybe I might have to go to a different states to try this out. Again, I, I haven't tried anything out on these mods yet, so Unrelenting Rush, what is this? Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's nice, dude. That is sick. Yo, how, how, how long is this combo? What? It's Unrelenting. I love the just combinations of things, man. What is this? What, what is that? Hold on, what? Okay, let me just get back up here. Cross arm dive. Okay. That's pretty cool looking. And we have the sledgehammer going on here. Boom! Look at that shit, dude. That is so sick. Holy crap. Okay. Flash thrust. Ooh, I like that move a lot. Yo, let's go. Let's get it. Mm. Boom, boom. <laughs> that is sick. So, yeah, whenever I transform into this, like, Super Saiyan stage, like, it, it just, like, I don't know, glitches out. I'm not sure what the issue is with that. Let me see here. Let me actually go for Unrelenting Rush again. Try to drain some key, and let me just see what's, what is what is with this freaking... I don't even understand why it's doing that. 
Okay, so it's like sledgehammer. What is that waste key bar? Okay, half legendary Super Saiyan. What? What? What, is, what are some of these moves? Okay, maybe if I'm up here and I'm locked on, it won't give me that issue. Let's see it. Yeah, it still does it, man. It still does it. I don't know what's wrong with the camera. Whenever that happens, it gets screwed up over here or something. Yeah, something's not right. All right, my friends, I am back in a different stage. Hopefully, the camera doesn't get all screwed up. So let's see it. There we go. So this is actually working. So now we actually know what these names are. So this is half legendary Super Saiyan. Moving on here, we have this one right here, which I think is supposed to be legendary Super Saiyan. And then we have like legendary Super Saiyan God, if I'm not mistaken. I think that's what how it goes. I think that's how it goes. I could be wrong on it, but. You know, I'm just going off of what was shown with that. So it says Legendary Super Saiyan God right there. So I'm going to expect as much and just say, hey, it works out. So that's pretty much all I wanted to showcase for the overall movesets and everything. I pretty much showed everything like Saiyan Spirit Alt, Unreal Life Team Rush, the cross arm dive. Did I actually show that one? Yes, I did. So uh, yeah, unfortunately, the transformation was, I guess, screwed up on that stage. Maybe because of the camera angles on it, because it's a lot smaller. But let's go ahead and move on to the Time Breaker forms. So Alina's mask is actually super unique and dope. I absolutely love the design for it. Dude, everything about this mod, man. Dexio, Azura, and DKN, guys. I love you dudes. Keep up the amazing work with your mods, man. They're just so sick. So I'm going to go ahead and go for this Corruption Fisher. I'm not sure. Does she have a different moveset? No, it's the same moveset, it looks like. But it's actually, you know, a different colored keyblade, which is pretty cool. We have this Corruption Fisher. Oh, my God. It actually makes a fissure in the ground. Like, did you see that? That is nuts. Okay, let's go for the super villain form. What is this? So you charge this up. Oh my god. Oh my god, dude. It's like legendary Super Saiyan Berserk. Are you kidding me? That looks crazy. What is this? Legendary Super Saiyan Berserk villainous form. I don't know what's happening anymore, bro. I just don't even know what to say. This is nuts, man. This is actual nuts. Yeah, I think that's all that it really showcases for the entire moves in terms of, like, transformation. So let's go and use Distorted Blast. What is that? Oh, that's nice, dude. That is nice. It creates a shockwave effect. It's a huge, giant blast that you can just constantly use. I love that. So let me actually get unlimited key on here so that we can constantly use this move. How many times can I use it? Boom. Boom. Oh, my God. So it doesn't have a lot of range, but it's still really nice. Instant Vanisher. Holy crap, that's like the move from Nappa. That's nice. We have the Darkness Edge. Ooh, ooh. I like that a lot. You could actually make that go into a combo. Ooh. She got a different moveset when she transforms. Oh my god. What is happening, bro? What is this? Yo. Oh my god. She is relentless. What is going on, man? Jesus. Oh, and then the backflip kick. Oh, let's go for the drug. We got a backflip kick. We got a freaking bicycle kick. That is so dope. That is way too cool, man. Oh my god, I don't even know anymore, man. Energy Jet. What is this? It's a giant key ball. And she's laughing about it, man. She thinks it's funny, man. Girl, you think this is funny, man? You, this ain't funny. I'm about to lose my freaking mind covering this mod, man. Oh my god, this is too much. This is, it's overwhelming. It's honestly overwhelming. Enraged Crash. Okay, that was a fail. Let's get it. Oh, 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 oh. Mmm! That it just keeps going, man. It just keeps going. Three blasts. She does one hand from the left, one hand from the right, and then boom, she does them dual hands, bro. Look at that. That is freaking nuts. Holy shiz. Jesus Christ, we got a trip going on too. God damn, dude, that is so sick. Alright, moving on, we're gonna go ahead and try out the final variation of this character. Alright, guys, so this is the final variation we got. A new mask on I don't think there's anything too different in terms of the moveset and everything but I'll still showcase it anyways because it looks really cool and we have the patron of time Goku Black going on so I don't think I showed off like the initial moveset for this version of her just from like the basis form so I guess we'll go ahead and do a couple of combos here like I said it's pretty much exactly the same I don't think it's really anything too different going on I think we've pretty much seen it we've got the stabs and you know just like the basic you know moveset and everything so we're gonna go ahead and go super villain form again it just looks so sick I absolutely love the transformation it makes that cool noise too so we have the energy jet which again I'm not sure what it is with like these stages I guess they mess up the camera certain stages do mess up the camera with certain movesets because they are custom they're that OP dude they really are 
This is instant vanisher, dude. I absolutely love seeing these crazy moves. So, yeah, that's pretty much everything. I mean, in terms of like the move sets and the overall design and everything, there's not a lot to it, but uh, you know, pretty much exactly the same to what we saw previously in the last, uh, you know, transformation and custom mod. But overall, I mean. This is, like I said, one of the most overwhelming crazy mods I've ever covered here on the channel. Hopefully you guys did enjoy it. I actually, like, loved it. Like, uh, nothing nothing about this went wrong other than, you know, the camera on certain stages. But other than that, like, it's just so cool, man. And I didn't even showcase one of the grabs. So we got to do a tradition of finishing off with a grab. Boom, just one massive throw. So there you have it. There is a line of the legendary Super Saiyan God Mastered Ultra Instinct Time Breaker Girl. That is going to whoop some ass. <laughs> Alright, my friends. So, thank you all so much for watching. Again, big shout-outs to Dexio, the homie Decat Yang, and Azura for creating these amazing, beautiful mods. They did such a fantastic job. And I just want to say, guys, you, you are truly talented, making the modding community a better place. Hopefully, we can see more stuff like this in the future. This is truly advancing and transcending, like I said in the beginning of the video, beyond mods. Like, this is something entirely like completely new in Xenoverse 2. Like Xenoverse 2 is not the same game it was with modding whenever we first, you know, played it back in 2016. This has truly changed. So thank you all so much. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Peace out, take care, and have an amazing day, my friends.